Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we're gonna be doing all about my setup and how I set everything up. I really wanna show you guys how everything is set up since um, I do videos on YouTube and some people do ask how everything is set up and how I get this lighting and where you can get the lighting and what you specifically need. This is the answer to that question. Why don't we go ahead and get this video started? But before we do, go ahead and hit that subscribe button right down below and also hit that little bell so you get a notification every time I upload a video. So without any further ado, let's Let's hop right into this video. So let me first take you through the entryway uh, to my door here uh, to the office slash recording room. So there's my desk and all my setup, how it usually is. Um, I chose to put the desk in the middle because I think it's great to kind of see who's coming in and then um, also the light from the window. I also chose this room because of the natural light, uh, which I wanted in my videos too. Plus the lighting, I do put this mirror here on the floor too to kind of see myself through the mirror uh, when I'm recording a video because I usually sit in that chair. So I can see myself and need to adjust anything, I can always do that. So this is my tripod right here. It is broken, I did put a rubber band around it to help me maneuver it. Uh, because it is broken uh, which works great and it's just because I'm cheap and I don't want to buy a new one um, that will just sit here in the room and do you know record videos so um, this works perfect and I fixed it so yeah these are my two lights um, of course they are uh, bulb lights they're not uh, LED I do want to get some LED ones to kind of cut the heat in the room but these work for now so uh, that works perfectly and then they're also attached by this cord which is linked to the wall and then you just switch them on with these two little switches, which um, it really is bright. These were about 60 bucks on Amazon for both, so it really helped and it lights me up right there in the chair. So moving on to what's on the side over here, um, I just have my camera equipment, some filing stuff, um, and just things like that. And then I also have my reflector, which is back here. Um, the reflector is double-sided. It's really old, actually. I've had it like for years. Uh, so that's why it kind of looks a little translucent, but it still does the job. I usually use the silver side um, and I lean it up against the tripod and I kind of like just lean it there and it just kind of like lights me up from, let me just move this around so you guys can actually see how it is set up usually because I really want to be true to how it's set up. So I lean it on the tripod right about there and then it sort of just like captures the light from the lights and then it just lights me up in my videos when I'm sitting right there. And it just gives like a nice uh, finish to the face, I guess, in the video. And I do put my desktop over here. I usually have it in front, like right there, but I have to move it and get it out of the shot. So I switch it to this side. And um, yeah, so this setup is really, really great. And it gives me a really nice, you know, finish and like look to the video, very professional. Uh, very professional. Um, I'm gonna show you right here how it kind of looks. So it gives me that kind of look, which I like. But yeah, let's go over to the closet and I'll show you guys what's in there. This is sort of like my little recording studio when I wanna record covers or I wanna do like a uh, voiceover or something like that. Uh, so uh, this is actually an old tripod for a camera that I used to have, uh, well that I had and I just tore off the top and placed this on it and it worked perfect. So um, yeah, I have some shoes up here and just random stuff like on the side and just things that are just random but the main thing is the microphone and um, having a concealed uh, compressed space to record. So yeah, uh, this is pretty much the whole setup. I also have my printer back here in case I need to print anything off for like some shipments or things that I'm doing um, and yeah but this setup has worked great for me and the chair I mean can we just talk about how good this chair is of course it's not the color that I would like I would like it to be black but I got it for 50 bucks and I'm planning to paint it sometime and maybe I'll do a video on that and show you guys how I paint it and make it look more I guess my aesthetic but by all means you don't need these bright lights uh, that you could use a bright window like this one but the bright lights definitely help and they were only 60 bucks on Amazon so I'll put a link in the description so you can find uh, lights like this um, and yeah they've been really useful they've lasted me at least a good like two years so far and they've done great I might use this bright window at some point for videos but I'm so glad I have a fan so that I can cool off the room with these bright lights because it does get hot so that's one thing that I will advise you if you're gonna be using bright lights like this make sure that you have 
a good uh, ventilated room that doesn't get too, too hot because it's kind of uncomfortable when you're sweating in your videos. <laughs> so that is pretty much it, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful and informational um, about my setup and how everything is done. So um, if you guys have any comments or any concerns or anything, go ahead and hit me up in the comments down below. And also give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And I will see you in the next video.